since I was a kid, and he played one of the most iconic characters in the franchise, and he did an amazing job. So, did you spend any time with the developers, the video game developers, to act uh, as a civil? Um, there was no time. I mean, I, 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 I met the director on Friday, I flew on Saturday, I started shooting on Monday, I literally like was being fit for leather pants, like the morning of, as they cut all my hair off. I was like, what have I gotten myself into? Um, no, but they introduced me to the video game, and, um, and I, because I, I really did not understand the script. If you read the script and you didn't know the video game, it literally was like, this is the weirdest thing. I don't know what any of this is about. Mind you, you watch the movie and you still don't know what any of it's about. But, um, but, uh, but I played the video game and, and was like really actually scared by the video game, but it gave me a real sense of like the world of Silent Hill, which was very helpful. And uh, again, I worked with really cool people and you know, we just kind of, you know, we worked as we, we went because the script was changing constantly. Like new pages all the time. Um, but uh, yeah, that was a brutal death. That was my next question. Yeah. When you see that scene where you're burning, you cringe, you do. I mean, does it feel comfortable? No, I actually think I'm like the stupidest girl on the planet because, like, I would never do that now. Sorry, I know that's not cool, but um, they really did put me over a fire. And um, first of all, I don't like heights. Second of all, my house had burned down three months prior, so I had a real problem with fire at the time. And they put me on... You know, whatever you see in that movie, that tall, tall, tall ladder, they hooked me onto it and they lowered me by a metal string over wooden um, spears that could have impaled me and fire. And it, it, we shot that over two days. And I, I now look back at this because I just wanted my director to be happy and I was just like, sure, I'll do it. Okay, I would not do that now because I could have died. Like, that was insane. That was crazy. That's what some people are for. But, um, I, I just, I mean, that's crazy. It was a string. You know, well, this, this is why it's so crazy. So, they, so, so they, they put this body cast under my tiny little leather outfit. Like, really? Like, you know, it's, as if there's any room to breathe with that outfit. So they, they put this cast on me, and I'm like, what's the, what's the first visit of the cast? And they were like, oh, well, it's flame retardant, and uh, if the string breaks, you won't get impaled and your body won't burn. I was like, okay, what about my face? <laughs> you know, they were like, oh, there's nothing we can do about that. So I'm wearing a body cast, so I'm not impaled and my body won't burn, but yet my face is gonna fall off, like, or like I'll get impaled through the skull. Like, I, does that make any sense to you? <laughs> right? And I still did it. <laughs> That's devotion. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay, thanks. Thanks. Thank you.